Hey everybody, uh, Brian here from quantlabs.net. Uh, just wanted to let people know as I move into uh, strategy development, moving uh, model development um, with R and R scripting versus something like uh, MATLAB. I uh, just wanted to show you some of the graphs and plots that are generated from some of these scripts. Uh, that I've um, improved upon from ones that have been uh, found on the web that actually do work. Um, I just want to show you some of them. Again, this is just for moving averages. So these two right here that you're looking at um, are just quick samples of uh, what's available, uh, doing comparisons of building uh, custom signals, custom indicators, um, and setting rules with R that you are able to uh, fully develop a whole suite of different types of charts. In this case, we have um, a custom uh, buy and hold, uh, what we call uh, an improved moving average based upon the signals that uh, have been seen. Uh, and, and you can improve on it. So there's, a, there's a, this, this, these custom R functions that have been found on the web that I've, I've seen. They seem to be okay in terms of work, uh, that they do seem to work. Um, and uh, they're, they're quite powerful. Um, there's the standard MA1, MA2, um, uh, some of the buy and hold. Uh, just, just to give you an example, these, these are from, you can do this with any any symbol which can be downloaded from Yahoo and a day uh, and um, just want to show you the, pr the, the, the typical performance you get on some of these uh, moving average uh, indicators. Um, first of all the power of R and same with MATLAB but it, you know you gotta remember that R and MATLAB are, are comparable actually I find R is a lot more advanced just due to the fact that some of these ingenious uh, package developers that uh, pa uh, develop some amazing R packages. If you're coming from the world of uh, of MATLAB, they're no different than the same as toolboxes. Uh, these packages are very advanced. Um, so in this case, uh, we've got uh, what you're looking at is a comparison between a fast, a slow, and a crossover moving av set of moving averages. Um, the, the the black would be uh, the um, any calculated uh, moving average, the, the the red would represent the, the 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 custom moving average, which has been improved upon the other traditional moving average you can call it. And then there's if you were to just do a basic buy and hold, you can see that the return is is, is much better. Uh, no f no and if ends or buts about it. And again, uh, with the time series that you work with, you can you can predict these, you can calculate these. And with um, with my additional methodologies, you can download your data uh, from some of that that's affordable, like an IQ feed of very affordable rates, and be able to generate these type of returns and what you see in blue that can blow away any typical moving average that you would get out of a out of a um, out of a, uh, a retail type of trading system, be it MetaTrader or whatnot. Again, this is all custom. Uh, you do get the source code. Uh, you do get the R scripts. I actually do a, a video walkthrough of the source code itself, um, and it, it works. It, it, it seems to um, build okay. Now, this is where the exciting part comes in. Let's say, just looking at these two uh, plots, if you were able to build a custom high-frequency trading platform or whatever volume you want to trade at, be able to load in your IQ feed data and then execute on trades based upon signals that your system will build based upon your data. That can be done all thankfully with the help of bridging between the, your C++ custom platform if it's an automated trading system that's what we're trying to achieve here be able to achieve build your custom indicators build your signals build your rules on the various R packages that are available out there and be able to build something like this showing these kind of blue lines. Um, like obviously you, you want to be able to test and test and test, back test, back test. I mean we all know that but I am at some point down the line gonna figure out how to automatically, let me repeat this, automatically back test for you. Uh, uh, against real data and you don't have to do anything in terms of visually looking at things and, and in my mind those days are done. 
so we've got these two plots. Uh, this is just one example. Again, uh, there are custom R functions that are, are provided that do some very powerful things. Uh, more low level. Um, the nice thing I, I'm mentioning the C++ custom trading platform, which is automa automatic or an, or an ATS, an algorithmic trace an ATS, which is an algorithmic tra uh, trading system or automated trading system that can do these type of calculations. You can also uh, have it create these type of uh, charts for you on the fly. Um, and uh, it's very powerful. And you can pass, collect the data in your C++ application. And within your C++ runtime, you can still call these R, R, R scripts. Uh, within your uh, C++ uh, runtime environment to get absolutely highest uh, level of performance and optimized, so it's 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 at the uh, the has the avail the highest and lowest latency possible, without going into the crazy coding of CUDA and GPU and all that stuff, which gets very very expensive. And any knowledgeable uh, programmer that knows how to do GPU or CUDA is going to be very, very expensive because that type of coding is very difficult and very uh, challenging and something I wouldn't want to do. And that's why I'm choosing to go this this route, which is a little easier, actually a lot easier to work with because you have both the R and the C++. But I'll get to that as I get to it, but I just want to show you the end result of some of the plots that are available for something like moving averages. So again, this is the moving averages for one set of... Um, applications. Let's pull up another one. Here's here here's another very powerful chart. This R package is is, is again mind blowing. Um, if it's a little hairier to work with, but if you go through the tutorials and spend the time and actually being able to code it up, you can automatically set your uh, indicators, your rules, your strategies, uh, take care of your equity positions, your closing out, calculate your your entry, your exit, it's all done and then boom it will apply that strategy um, in a totally different process to simulate it to do all your back testing which this is um, and generate these type of plots so again you can see that uh, we've got the different types of uh, uh, moving averages again simple improved uh, and, and then there's a, the improved original and, the, and this custom one of, of the uh, here's a simple, the improved variation, uh, the improved original, and just using the buy and hold. Again, buy and hold is always high. I don't know why, but uh, we can always thank uh, Mr. Lynch for that. Not only that, but we get our monthly return, and we can also calculate uh, our, our drawdown as well for each of these type of plots. Very powerful. Uh, and you can see it visually uh, and you can actually extract the data so you can also within your trading platform be able to build custom rules say okay if you see this do this do that exit enter and this is all again forecasted so let's look at another set of um, of uh, charts here this this is a performance again on a system of various types of uh, 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 strategies that have been run, uh, be it, uh, I don't know, the R squared, information correlation, P value, all this stuff. And using again that buy and hold, improved, and the improved original. So, very advanced uh, type of plotting, be able to get access to the data, and, and this is all within the moving average type of R scripts that are available in the membership for uh, my Quant Lab members. These are very powerful um, and I just don't think you'll be able to find something like this where you get also um, the source code for the R scripts fully customizable um, and being able to run it very quickly. Um, uh, I'm, 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 I'm just amazed at what the potential of this is and again it's, it can be fully automated as well. So I just wanted to show that to you, uh, that this, these videos are going to be posted very quickly uh, over the next few days and will be ready uh, for uh, my, my membership. Um, and we're just getting started now. We've just done Garch, we've done Arima, uh, and now we're um, applying so many um, 
uh, types of models, be it uh, next lot will be pairs trading, co-integration, um, and start moving into the more, oh, actually we've got mean reversion in there as well. And then we're going to start moving into some of the more advanced, or I, I call it quanti type of modeling, be it uh, uh, MCMC, Markov chain with Monte Carlo. Uh, there's also going to be, I'm just thinking off the top of my head, PCA, Bayesian as well, which I was kind of, when I looked at it, I was just blown away on the potential of that. Not a lot of people know about what Bayesian can do. Um, and it just, it just doesn't stop. So I'll be doing this full craziness of, of different types of modeling. Um, and as I said, I've got videos uh, for each type of a strategy model and R script that I put up, as well as there's the R script itself. Uh, that you can implement into your own systems if you do choose to use R. And again, you do get the source code of the R script. And for those that don't know, uh, if you do plan to go with a C++ type of system, um, what needs to be understood is that R is completely written in R. Uh, sorry, R is written in C. So basically what am I saying is that R is an extension of another C program. Not only that, but you can always at some point, you can download the source code for R itself. If you really want to go nutty with it and build your own custom version of R, you can do that too. Um, so you get complete source code from end to end, uh, from the C++ side on your trading system all the way to your model and your strategies right within R. Very powerful stuff. And this is just a small, small demo of what is possible out there with just something simple like a moving average. And we're not even doing any advanced quanti stuff. This is just typical technical uh, tra te technical trading kind, kind of stuff. Very powerful. I encourage you to uh, follow along as I proceed with it because I'll be posting these type of videos on YouTube uh, as I get to it. Um, very exciting. And um, I'm hoping to see you on the other side as, as I'm going to present these in live demo webinars in a full on Q&A as best my ability to be able to answer all that stuff. And we are getting a solid community of some pretty senior uh, developers that have developed some really, really awesome stuff on, on, on exchanges. Um, so I'm quite proud uh, of where things are at this point. So um, in a nutshell, you know what to do. Join now.